It feels amazing to live in a decluttered space, but the job itself can be quite overwhelming. Where do you start? What should you focus on? How do you decide what to keep and let go of? And how can you find the time to do it around work and family life and the kids? My answer to these is pretty much the same as my answer to everything. Look for an easier way, take it step by step. Hi, I'm Marissa from Beautifully Organized and today we are talking about things that you can declutter quickly and easily. There's no perfect way to declutter, so let's get rid of that stress right away. But an easy way to declutter? That I can help you with. Here are 20 things you can declutter quickly and easily without too much sentimental pressure, overwhelm or difficult decision making. You can choose one of these to do each fortnight and by the end of the year, you'll be amazed at how much extra space you have and how much easier it is to maintain your home. Number one is expired pantry items. This is the easiest and most guilt-free thing to declutter. You can get rid of the out-of-date food in your pantry, start with the spices, move on to the canned goods and then the packaged products. Number two is extra coffee cups. You don't need 20 mugs for a four person family. Keep two per family member and let the rest go. Number three is boxes you were saving just in case. You can get boxes anytime you need them. We get them for free at Bunnings here in Australia or you can ask on Facebook. Multiple friends will have some and will happily give them to you. Number four is shop catalogs. These are so easy. You don't need the paperwork. Just look online for your latest deals. Number five is old candles. We burn them down until we can't light them anymore and then they stay in the cupboard for months. It's okay to let these go and make space for new ones. Number six is expired medicines. Just bag them up and take them to your local pharmacy, your local chemist for safe disposal. Number seven is old gluggy nail polishes. You know the ones that are really hard to open and then you put them on and they give that first really thick layer. Time to let them go. Number eight is DVDs. Come on, you know that you're streaming instead now and they're just sitting on the bookshelf gathering dust. Let's donate them. Number nine is old notebooks. Do you ever read through them again? If not, time to recycle them. Number 10 is handbags that you haven't used in the last 12 months. We tend to have one bag for day, one bag for special occasions, maybe keep a third for a bit of variety, but you don't really need any more bags than that. Number 11 is pens and textures that don't work. It's actually really soothing to go through them and test them on paper, throwing out the dry ones as you go. Number 12 is kitchen gadgets that you haven't used in the last year. You might miss it once or twice when it's gone, but honestly, you can probably live without it quite easily. For me, it's my waffle maker. Number 13 is cords and chargers that you don't use anymore, especially if you can't remember which item it's for. Number 14 is extra drink bottles and lunch boxes. If you get new ones every year, don't keep the old ones. You'll just clutter up your cupboards with them. Let them go. Number 15 is a really, really easy one. Old magazines, declutter them. Number 16 is hot hair tools that you don't use anymore. They're taking up space for no reason. You can stick to your hairdryer, your straightener and one curler and that's all you need. Number 17 is toys that are broken or have missing pieces. Let's be real, nobody's playing with those anymore. Number 18 is owner's manuals or appliances. Honestly, they're all online now, whether they're new or old. Number 19 is clothes that don't fit. They're gonna be out of date by the time they fit you again. Treat yourself to a couple of nice outfits that make you feel great whenever your clothing size goes up or down. And number 20, our last one is old makeup. Trust me, your skin will thank you for it. Check the label and let it go if it's past its use by recommendation. There's a little symbol that looks like a container with the lid open that'll let you know ideally how long to keep that makeup for. And that's my 20 favorite things to declutter quickly and easily. I hope you found this list helpful. When you're ready for the next step, join the free Neat and Tidy Challenge. You can click the link below to join us there and you'll get an email from me once a month with tips on clearing out, cleaning, and maintaining a different space in your home each month. That's it from me today. I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Wait, I'm just gonna take this off, hang on. I can't, I can't get the mic out, hang on.
It's a glamorous life. Hi, I just wanted to let you know before you watch the next video, we have some really good resources that are totally free and we run regular workshops online. So you can join me live if you want to. Check out the links below and hopefully I'll see you there soon.